Hello friends and family. I'm back with a little hot sauce review. This one, it's kind of a little gateway sauce. Well, it is a gateway sauce, but this actual flavor I've never seen. Definitely down here in Tennessee. Uh, some good friends of ours went to uh, New York, went to Niagara Falls, renewed their vows on their honeymoon. Or not on their honeymoon, shoot, on their anniversary, went and renewed their vows and, uh, at Niagara Falls and brought me back habanero flavored Tabasco sauce. Never seen it. And I'm a big habanero fan. <clears throat> the back of the box says, some like it hot, but for those who like it hotter, there's Tabasco habanero sauce. We mix one of the world's hottest peppers with mango, papaya, and more to create a sizzling Jamaican style blend. Give a Caribbean kick to jerk chicken, shrimp, kebabs, and sauces. Sprinkle some on anything you're enjoying to add hot enough and get fired up for some serious flavor. Shake wet. Gotta make this one a little snappy. The sun's getting on me. I love the bottle. I like the, the label. It says, not for the faint of palate, Tabasco habanero sauce is made from one of the world's hottest peppers. This Jamaican style pepper sauce is a great as a marinade or as a dipping sauce. Proceed with caution. I don't know about all that, but. Uh, we're definitely going to give it a shot. It's the uh, biggest combos I like the most is mangoes and habaneros. And then it adds papaya into it too, so. Ingredients are distilled vinegar, habanero pepper, cane sugar, Tabasco pepper. Uh, ba, 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 ba. It says Tabasco pepper sauce, distilled vinegar, red pepper salt, salt, mango puree, dehydrated onion, banana puree, tomato paste, tamarind puree, papaya puree, spices, garlic, Tabasco pepper mash, and aged red bell pepper and salt. Shake well. Man, I'm super excited for this sauce. I was going to do it on this week's Saucy Sunday. Couldn't wait. It smells like habanero. And it smells like mango. So, typical little Little mouth Tabasco bottle. Oh yeah. You get it on the spoon, you get a wider variety of all the things going on in there. You can smell the garlic. You can definitely smell the mango. I'm not 100% sure what papaya smells like, but I'm pretty sure it's in here. I can almost pick the banana up. Anything banana flavoring is a little, little strong. All right, guys, enough stalling. Here we go. Now, I ain't gonna lie. That's got a nice little burn to it. That's really good. Oh, 
I mean, 100% picking up the habanero. And I guess the mango. Y'all look all right, guys? No, I'm just kidding. Man, that's a good sauce. I love the faded, the label. Now, one Tabasco sauce that I'm in search of, and I guess I might order it, is the scorpion. I'm pretty, I'm, I'm at about imagine that's pretty hot, because this is pretty warm right here. Habanero is number two ingredient. So, you guys like my button. Go check out everything spicy. Awesome channel. If you ain't already got him by now, you're missing out. Go grab him up. I'm sure most everybody that follow me follow him too. I hope. Go check him out. Everything spicy. I can't get enough of this burn. I love the burn. I'm addicted to the burn. Never thought in a million years I'd be eating hot stuff. A couple years ago, I wouldn't. I used to get acid reflux real bad, and I finally found me some good heartburn pills to take. I hate taking pills of any kind. Anybody that knows me knows that. And I used to take the old heartburn pills I used to have. I took four a day, two in the morning, two in the evening. Now the ones I found, <clears throat> I'll take one in the morning and that's it. And I don't have heartburn at all. And I mean, even after all this hot stuff I eat. Sometimes, like right now, I can feel it in my chest. But, uh, good stuff. Go check it out. Tabasco habanero with mango puree and pap papaya puree. Even banana puree. I don't I don't taste the banana in it. I do taste the mango and I'm sure I taste the papaya, but I'm I'll have to go buy one and bite into it, I guess. Guys, definitely 100 percent go check this out. Leave a comment section below. If you've had the habanero Tabasco, man, this would be good on chicken. I'm not a shrimp guy, but it would be good on shrimp. Uh, and it may be good on crawfish. I do like crawfish, but I don't like shrimp. Uh, spice up anything, like your salsa, any, a little dash will do you, you know what I'm saying? You can do it. This would be the way to go. The mango in it's not overpowering. You can taste it on the spoon straight up, but I think if you go to add it in something, some chilies or I'd put this on pizza. I'd put it in my chili. I'd put it. It's not that overbearing. It's just a good flavorful sauce. Guys, go check them out. I'll put a link to it in the description box. Like the video. Uh, leave a comment below if you've had it. Tabasco habanero. Subscribe to the channel. Got a lot of stuff coming up. Like I said, Saucy Sunday is every Sunday. Uh, reviewing hot sauce on Sundays every Sunday. Got the wedding coming up. It should be a big video for the wedding. Uh, got some spicy challenges involved with my brother-in-law and my daddy-in-law, and it ought to be pretty entertaining. I promise. That'll be on October 19th. Got StreamYard downloaded on my phone. Uh, Going to be testing it out this week. Be going live for too long. One day a week. Uh, probably on the weekend. But uh, you guys have a good evening. Good safe day. And I'll see y'all on the next one. I love y'all.